Hello everybody, Aquagear here, and welcome back to another episode of Aqua's Adventure. Today, we are back on my single player world. And I've done a lot of work since you last saw me, which I'm going to be showing right now. Uh, so I'm going to be kind of going through a couple things that I've done. You might notice these cakes. Well, you might say, oh, why did I make the cakes, or where did they come from? Well, uh, a couple episodes ago, we got these villagers. And uh, I started trading with them, and like this guy, I think has the cake trade right here, yeah. I've been trying to unlock the cake trade. Uh, I've been trading with, no, I didn't trade at all with that guy. I know I traded with this guy right here uh, for the flint. He didn't unlock that, though. And, yeah, I, I think I tried with this guy once. Yeah, I did a little bit of training, that's why you might see a couple cakes surrounding me. You know, I didn't want to go to waste. Uh, this chicken farm was actually broken. It was broken. I don't know how it got broken, but it was broken. So, uh, I went along and fixed it. I went back to the tutorial, and once again, we're getting chicken and stuff, so. That's amazing, so. So far, played with the villagers, <coughs> fixed the chicken farm, and you might see a huge hole down here. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I noticed, hold up, I don't have a mine. On my old house, I had a mine. There's no mine at this house. Uh, that's some of the cobbles that I got from here. So I built a mine. I'm going to be adding in stairs in today's episode, uh, maybe adding a couple lights, but you might say, oh, well, why'd you get the idea of doing this? Well, uh, when I hopped down a couple days ago thinking, okay, I'll, I'll do some mining while off camera, you know, just get some resources. But I said, I don't have a place to mine. I usually just go somewhere and start mining. But I said, you know what? I want an official mine. So I went along and built this place. That's just really how it happened. I wanted, I wanted a mine. And I didn't want to do this entire thing on camera. I said, I'll decorate it on camera. But I won't actually build it on camera. But with that, you might say, well, did you end up going mining? And, whoops. <laughs> and, and with that, I'm going to say, yes, I did. And I'll show you guys what's in this box right here. By the way, guys, see this door right here? I built this like a year ago, I think. This is a very, very, very outdated door. So I actually might want to rebuild this. This door, if you guys don't know, was built by me. Like, completely by me. I went on camera and built it just like that. I didn't follow a tutorial. So this door really stinks. I mean, it does its purpose, but look how huge it is. This entire thing is a redstone for it, so, yeah. This door, this door isn't very amazing, but the only reason I love it so much is because it was designed and built by me. That's the only reason I love it so much. Real quick, let's go say to old pumpkin, old pumpkin face, old pumpkin head. Anyway, so guys, if you guys do want to play a little game, guess, I mean, I don't want you guys to guess every ore in here. Guess how many diamonds I got. Go in the comment section and tell me how many diamond ore I got. Ore, because I silk touched it. I'm just going to tell you guys it's not a lot, so don't guess like 50. But just guess how many diamond ore. And let's reveal. Alright. So again, I didn't do a lot of mining because I was cut short uh, from doing something. But I got quite a bit of coal. Oh, and that's why you might notice a water bucket and my silk touch in my inventory because I just came on from uh, mining. So I got like four stacks of coal, which is fine. 59, or, no, coal, just coal, not, <laughs> not coal ore. I got practically a stack of redstone ore. I accidentally um, broke some of it. You probably could have seen. I got two stacks of iron, which is good. Eight diamond ore. Which I do actually have a clip of getting. So I'm going to be playing that right now. Diamonds. Diamonds. Well guys, those were the two clips for getting the diamonds. I know they weren't a lot. I mean, they were just getting diamonds. And I didn't want to make an entire documentary on, on getting diamonds. So they were pretty short. I think the second one got cut off. But I'm not worried about it. The point is, I got diamonds. So... I got a couple more. I'll play with these auras in a little bit. But one thing I want to do right now is, like I said, I built the mine and I want to put stairs inside the mine. And I actually haven't decided yet what I'm going to make the stairs out of. So I guess we'll have to decide now. 
Let's see, what materials do we have? Do we have any stone? If I can make them out of stone, I want to make them out of stone. Okay, yeah, we have enough. Uh, I got a bunch of cobble from actually mining out the place, and I've got a bunch of coal from uh, uh, mining out <laughs> during the place. So, I'm, I can afford to make some stairs right now. Let's see. I'll just use all of it. I don't even care anymore. Alright, let's go down there and see if we actually have enough. Cake, cake, cake. I might actually use that cake for eating soon. Let's start from the bottom. Because if we start from the top, it's going to be really difficult. And I guess I haven't even shown you the bottom yet. So at the bottom, I did hit lava. And I, like I used my water bucket to turn things into obsidian. But then I ended up just like... Oh, is that my silk touch? Okay, good. See what I ended up doing here? I was going to make it go like even a step lower. Then there ended up being bedrock right here. So, you, so I said, I would love to have this right here, but it looks so ugly. I just said, nah. So I just covered it up. So I'll stop the mine right there. But on these sides over here, that doesn't look right. Alright, so I'm going to have to lift up. Of these things, I think by a block then, or I could do something better. I could lower these by a step. So yeah, I'm gonna have to go and do this. I didn't realize that the stairs would do this. That works out. And then the sides of the walls again are gonna be decorated too with probably stone brick. I mean, a mine is a mine. I don't knock. I'm not gonna decorate it with gold blocks. That's not gonna make any sense. So, from the mine, I got stone, and I'm going <laughs> to decorate it with stone. That's how it goes. So, this is probably going to take... A, this actually might take longer than actually removing those blocks. And, by the way, guys, if I do... I don't know if I already said this in the video, but... If I sound a little dull, or a little bit, like, dry, it's because it's, like, 7 in the morning here, and... Yeah, I never wake up 7 in the morning other than school, but today I decided that... Today is Tuesday, I have school off, I think some meetings or something with the teachers, so they let us go off, and that means I'm going to work hard at recording. So what I plan today is, I'm waking up at 7, I'm going to record a long, long, long time, so I'm going to try to get like, I'm not going to eat, like maybe like 5 to 6 videos done a day, so I always like to have 5 or 6 videos in my uh, hard drive, just, well, yeah, I have my hard drive, just in case maybe my headset breaks, my computer has a problem with noise, which has happened before. Maybe I'm gone on vacation, so I have something to upload while that problem is there. Uh, like, a while back, my computer actually broke, sort of. You guys didn't even know it, but my computer actually was broke for maybe like a week or two. And I couldn't fix it, but I had like four videos pre-recorded so I uploaded those every like two or three days and that actually kept me good while I was fixing my computer if you guys don't know that so I always do like to keep extra videos so like on days like today where I have nothing to do I record a bunch and I get things done but anyway guys we're done yay <laughs> um, so again still a lot of decoration to go it's not even half the battle yet but I I don't know if I want to spend an entire video <laughs> building a mine. So I don't know. I might find something else to do. But let's see. Where's... And guys, last episode I said I would like place these in certain places. But yeah, I still haven't done it. My bad, guys. But I just... <laughs> I don't know. I mean, like, I love being organized and I hate being organized. But one thing I want to do I actually do want to get started on is if we look in this chest over here again we got some soul sand and we got some nether rack nether wart my bad well and nether rack but I was thinking we should start maybe a nether rack farm so I don't know if I want to start with that today but that would be a fun project okay well guys I'm gonna stop recording real quick and see where my timings at and then we'll start on a project Welcome back, everybody, and you might be wondering, where are we? This is not <laughs> your single-player world. Well, real quick, 
I hopped into a redstone testing world and I built myself a farm before I actually did it on Aqua's Adventure. And this is it. You might say, whoa, this is kind of extensive, isn't it? Well, that's kind of the point. I wanted this to be a bigger farm. The rest of the farms are small, compacted farms. This is going to be a fairly large farm. So if you don't know how this works, this is supposed to be a button right here, but I forgot to switch it out, but that's fine. Uh, so what you do is you press the button, and it activates all these dispensers right here in the back. Although, all those dispensers have water inside of them, so if you press this button... Water will come all the way across and stop right there on every single one of them. And obviously, nether, nether wart is going to be on every single one of those. So all the nether wart just comes to the edge here and drops right into here. And bang, this is where the nether wart goes. And you, you guys might say, oh, well, how do you refill it? You need to get inside of there to plant the nether wart. Uh, well, if we come back here, there's a little ladder. And over here, there's a little step for each one. So you come in here, replant, go up. Come in here, replant. So that's all you do. It's a very simple farm. It does do a little bit of manual work, but it's very worth it. I I filled up the, these two and then this one up here. And just from those two layers, I got about this much. If I fill up this entire thing, I could probably get maybe all the way, maybe like um, 15 stacks maybe from one go. So that's very good. And also, it's very profitable. So I'm really really excited to build this farm with all the materials oh the materials that is going to take a while also guys to note that I can even expand this like this way I just have to move this over here and expand the dispensers I think I can expand it maybe by one or two more but I don't know if I'm going to be doing that I might just leave it just like this I mean this is huge enough and this farm will be perfect for ours I'm just ah uh, the gathering of the resources is gonna take a while but that's one thing I'm going to have to do so I'll meet you guys back in Aqua's adventure well guys in this episode I don't think we're actually gonna be able to get started on the project but one thing that we will have to do is we're gonna have to start getting materials together also picking out a spot the spot I'll pick later but let's get a few materials together that we know we'll need so obviously we'll need a little bit of nether wart We'll need all the soul sand we could get. Even this is not going to be enough. I'll have to go get more. Uh, let's grab all the redstone we have. Uh, we will have to make it out of a certain building material, but that'll probably, I'll probably just pick later. Let's grab all the iron we have. Um, let's see. Is there like an extra lapis chest? I don't, I don't even remember anymore. But yeah, all this stuff we will need. We could build it out of wood, but I don't know. So all this we'll need so far trying to think We're, we need a lot of glass and again all that stuff's not gonna be enough i'm gonna have to go out and get more oh, redstone right here all right yeah i'm gonna have to use all this Do we have any glass this glass will be used do we have any sand anything really at this point even uh i don't know i'm probably debating out of either wood or stone so the, those are the two most abundant things these things have to go on here Let's see, we'll go back outside. So, let's see this. I'll grab all of this, because <laughs> I'm going to need these. Yeah, so you guys kind of get the drill. I'm going to have to collect all the materials for, like, the dispensers. Yeah, I'm going to need some string. Let's see, I'm going to... Let's, let's go get some string. I know I don't have a bunch, and I don't even have any at all. Okay, well, I'll have to go collect some later on. So, yeah, glass, stuff like that. But guys, real quick, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the nether, I'm going to go to a desert, I'm going to go everywhere, and I'm going to go collect some stuff.
Welcome back, everybody. So, I got all my gear back on. I got my diamond tools. I got my food back. But you also notice I have quite a few more levels now, which is great. Uh, right before this, I showed a couple clips of me getting materials together, like uh, maybe cooking some sand, cooking some stone, which I do have in there. Getting some string. I did get a lot of string. I showed maybe like a battle with a couple spiders, but I did get a pretty good amount of string. Uh, I crafted good amount of dispensers I got some soul sand gathered some sand so I did a lot of things I just showed probably a clip of each uh, yeah but I actually want to show you guys what I got right here so BAM that's a lot so you could obviously tell what I had before so I already had this stuff but I did get a, a little bit more sand I did cook a lot of it so this is a lot of the cooked the cooked sand uh, I did go get some more soul sand, so I went through the nether, got soul sand. I got, like, two stacks of string, but I did already craft, like, 31 dispensers, which is all great. So, and I got, I cooked up some stone. Um, so, yeah, we did get a lot of materials together. I don't know if that's going to be enough. I, I'm going to be painfully honest. I don't even know if this is going to be enough, but hopefully it will be enough. But also, since I did kill a lot of spiders, I did gain a lot of levels, and that means enchanting time. So, what are we going to enchant today? We can enchant two things at the moment. You know what? I'm feeling an axe and a shovel. That's what I'm feeling right now, so let's... Oh, yeah. Alright, do we have... You know what? I'm just going to take both of these diamonds. I don't care. I'm going to save my ore until I get a four... Oh, where did that diamond go? Are you serious? Come on, Diamond, where'd you go? Are you serious? Where'd he go? Oh, that's horrible luck. Oh, over here. How'd I get all the way over here? That's crazy. Uh, once I fortune um, the Diamond Ore, I'll put like a diamond back in the item frame. But for now, I'm just going to take these diamonds because I feel like being cheap. And let's do it. So a shovel and an axe. Okay, let's go enchant these things. Sorry about that. Okay, let's keep going and enchant these things. Alright, let's grab our shovel. Let's hope for two good enchant- Oh, I need my lapis. Alright, my bad. Let's go grab some lapis. I always forget the lapis. Always. Okay, let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. Perfect. Oh, by the way, guys, if you haven't, <laughs> like, um, been up to date with Minecraft, now, enchanting takes lapis and three levels for a three level enchant, which is amazing. What? Are you serious? Efficiency one? Are you kidding me? Is it the same? Th oh, my bad, guys. My bad. I, I feel really, really dumb right now. I have to remove these things right here. Or it doesn't work. So let's put them in now. Bang. Fortune two. Efficiency. You know what? I don't like any of those. Let's see what the shovel can get. Seriously, same thing. Ah, oh, man, I don't want to do that. Alright, you know what, guys? Let's do something. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna enchant some crap item. Oh, let me, you know what? Let me just grab this axe. Let's go kill one cow because we're almost at 34, and I'll show you guys what I'm gonna do. Because I don't like those enchantments. Those are horrible enchantments right now. Let's go out here. Let's just kill an animal. Get to 34. Okay, you're gonna die. Did I get XP? Yeah, there we go. 34. Let's just drop these things for now. Because I don't really need those. Unless I just want to go enchant. So let's go enchant. Hopefully, we'll get a good enchantment this time. Not like that crap. But let's put one in here. Efficiency 1. Okay, whatever. It doesn't really matter. But now we need to go get another piece of lapis. <laughs> Yay! Oh, wow, this is this is tedious. Just to get an enchant. All right, let's let's grab one more piece. There we go. And let's go back and enchant. Let's go. Come on, good enchant, please, 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 give me a good enchant. Come on, efficiency four. I'll take it. Just efficient. Wow. Okay. Well, I mean that's efficiency four. I'll take it. I'm breaking three. Yes. That. All right. I'm happy with that. I am happy with that. But guys, I think we did a lot of work. Ugh, I'm trying to mess with my inventory. We did a lot of good work today. 
Uh, we ended up enchanting two items. We got a lot of resources together. As you can see from this little chest right here, that's a lot of resources. But we didn't get time to get to the big project today, but we will get to the big project either very, very, very soon or maybe right in the next episode. So um, hopefully that'll be fun. So we'll be building another farm, another wart farm, my bad. And that's going to work like a charm. But anyway, guys, this has been Aqua Gear. Thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like and a comment as it supports my channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.